This is the National Video Journalist Network. Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we've traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Noel S. Ruiz Theater at CMPAC for the ninth annual Teeny Awards. This year we have over a hundred nominees and it has grown immensely, the program. I, I think that the competition is so fierce that the schools really look at each other and say, okay, what are you doing? What are you doing? And it's great. It's really terrific. The um, Many schools did the same play, but in a different variety. So it's interesting to see how this is done. The sports get all the recognition, and all of these kids who work so hard in theater, whether it's backstage, on stage, or it's the lighting, or the text, or the design of the program, and, of course, the theatrical performances. You say, why shouldn't they be recognized just the same way? So that's how the TD Awards were devised. Islip Arts Council does a lot of wonderful programs, but this is ter terrific. It spotlights all our high schools, all these students in drama, and they work so hard all year, and it's a chance that they all get to see and share uh, all their talents with each other throughout the town of Isop on one night. Who cares about the world outside and what it wants from you? When you're in Adams, you do what Adams always do. It's been such a privilege and a pleasure to be here year after year for the Teeny Awards, to see the great work that our young people do in stage, theater, music, it's just wonderful. As a musician myself, I really look forward to tonight. Central Islip High School, guys and dolls. I won the Student Pit Orchestra Award. And having to work with the choirs and the directors and all the actors themselves to coordinate with the actual orchestra itself, it's definitely, definitely some stressful work. But, you know, it, it came together and made such a great finishing product. One on the queue, the Little Mermaid, Brickwood High School. I got director's pick. It's just a big accomplishment. I've been in the music program, the musical theater program for 10 years with my school, and it just, it feels really good that he thought I was one of the most dedicated students. And the award goes to Megan Doyle for Guys in the I won the teeny for a stage manager. In like our production, they called me the brain because uh, I reminded our director of everything he had to do, like ordering t-shirts. Um, I was in charge of calling cues for lights and audio and mics and all that other stuff and making sure everybody was where they needed to be. It feels really good. I mean, the production was my biggest payoff. It really was. So I am very proud to give the award for student choreography and dance captain to Caitlin Rogers. Guys and it's really nice to be recognized. It's an honor to realize how much hard work I've put in. Um, people recognize it and that people appreciate it. Being a senior, I think, just makes the whole experience a lot better for the fact that, like, I get to finish off on, like, a really high note. I got the special recognition for art design for the Laramie Project. It was my uh, theater teacher, Mrs. Pincus, who recommended me to do the uh, design, so I thought I'll try it out, and look where that got me. <laughs> Theater is one of the most important things that I think kids can participate in. It teaches so much poise, confidence, leadership, uh, community service. It teaches how to be part of a team. There's just everything, whatever you're looking for, you can find it in theater. God love 